Pikmin fucking 4. Of course, of course, I didn't stream the direct. Of course. And then they show you this beautiful trailer and the release date. It's in six months, less than that, right? Oh my god. Ah, so excited. Um, but anyway, anyway, we have Kingdom Hearts voice actor trivia. I hope you're all doing well today. This is Puffin Man's voice actor trivia. I believe the format here is you'll be given a character um, outside of Kingdom Hearts and a picture of that character, and you'll be asked to name uh, the voice actor, or rather the, the character that, that uh, is shared by that voice actor, I think. It's something like that. Um, so we'll be uh, getting that code up here. And let me copy this. Also, Tears of the Kingdom uh, at the end of uh, at the end of the direct. Which voice actor has sung "Happy Birthday" to me? Did anybody know the answer? Any non-patrons know the answer to that? Um, let's see. Pin that. Yes, yeah, someone in Kingdom Hearts did sing "Happy Birthday" to me. Yes, Richard Epcar. That is that is correct. I will treasure it forever. And some Seeker of Darkness <laughs> singing "Happy Birthday" to me. Uh, really amazing stuff. Um, and then uh, after we do this, we're going back to BBS. Uh, you folks can choose who we play as and what we do, just like last time. I guess I kind of uh, <laughs> I kind of lied because I I kind of picked what I wanted to do. You you guys voted for uh, ice cream beat, but we did like chess collection for the uh, the first part of that. We still got to get all the chests as Terra and Ven, all the stickers. We have to do. Really everything. Like <laughs> we did ice cream beat to get the the maestro trophy. That was our big trophy get last time. Um, so a lot of it's like working towards those report uh, trophies, unfortunately. Um, oh yeah, and then uh, you got Game Boy on uh, Switch, which you know, fine, good, better to have it than not. But uh, that should have been there from the beginning. Uh, this console's been out since 2017, right? Like, what are we doing? What are we doing getting games from literally, what, 1989? 1988? Like, when did the, when did Game Boy come out? When the fuck did uh, Game Boy release date, USA? I just wanna see here. Yeah, July 31st, 1989 is when the Game Boy released in the States, a couple months earlier in Japan. Um, why did it take us until 2023 to get Game Boy games on the Switch? You know? I'm, I'm not trying to be a curmudgeon. And yeah, like, good good job adding the GBA as well. Which, again, both of those were on the Wii U. And when, what, 2014 at the latest, I think? Um, and then, of course, you gotta pay more for GBA games. Which I will not be doing. Uh, I know how to play GBA games without the Switch, that's fine. Or GBA, for that matter. Um, Deep Barty Lore. I was bribed with a Game Boy to be potty trained. Nice. I was bribed with a uh, Barney VHS. Um, I believe he was, uh, it was like some kind of party or like a fair, like some kind of, um, like a fun fair Barney thing. I believe he was in like a hot air balloon of some sort. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm, uh, I'm not, I've never been impressed by the Switch's, uh, you know, um, backlog of content in terms of like the older systems it's just not really uh just for 2023 especially it's like come on um <clears throat> no one had a bribe no one had to bribe me i came out knowing where to poop i didn't i i pooped in several different places before uh, they had to uh, you know rein me in uh let me get my book it up here a reminder that i got fifth uh on the last one <coughs> um, let's see. Three nine, one two, four four one. Speaking of cage voice actors, was uh was it not Matthew Mercer as Ganondorf in that uh, Tears of the Kingdom trailer? Um, that's nuts. Um, who should I be? Um. I'll, I'll, I'll be Epcar Pat in honor of the, uh, the birthday message. All right. Um, I'm not sure if he confirmed it himself, but it seems like everybody is saying it is. You gotta talk DD down from getting the, <laughs> the NSO expansion pass. Yeah. Yeah, like, there should have been, not only should there be GameCube stuff, and even Wii stuff, to be honest, on the Switch, but it should have been there 
like half of the console's life cycle ago. Like, I just have no idea how you bungle it that hard. Um, I'd, I'd much rather... So can you still buy stuff on the Wii U? Is that still a thing? Or do they shut down the, uh, the eShop for that? Because my Wii U, I mean, I haven't, I haven't used it in probably two years at this point, but like that was basically like my old Nintendo game console. I bought Superstar Saga on that. I got Ruby and Sapphire Pinball. I got the Mystery Dungeons, um, Paper Mario N64. What else did I get? Um, I think I got Super Metroid. You may not escape me. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, but that's a, that's a hot commodity. That's my old Nintendo, and I used to use it for Netflix, so. Um, how will they make money off of, uh, <laughs> of a half-assed remaster if the old games are already on the console? That's true. But, like, not even that. They can't even do that, right? You can't even play, like, Pikmin 4 is coming out. You can play Pikmin 3 on the Switch, but where are you going to play 1 or 2? You need to get the either the GameCube or the new Play Control copy. And uh, I did watch Netflix on the Wii. Honestly, it wasn't that bad. Uh, it worked. Um, I think I, uh, God, should I, like, return to Pikmin 2 and then play Pikmin 3 on stream before 4 comes out? I mean, I have several months to do it. Um, you can feel the calm, the chain of memories, PJ? Is it coming? <clears throat> it's on the horizon? For Switch? You think? That'd be pretty neat, but... I mean, GBA is an option now. It's common. <laughs> uh... Oh, yeah, there was a leak, wasn't it? Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> yeah, I know. Vodka wanted Pikmin 2 to continue months ago, but uh, I uh, I think now that we have the Pikmin 4 on the horizon, it makes more sense. Um, you you d definitely don't, uh, Daybreak. Certainly not. Um, you can definitely pick it up with 4. You can pick it up with any of them and then play them in any order. Um, I mean, 1 and 2 are a bit more... It feels like 1, 2, and 3 are going to be more connected to each other than 4 is. 4 kind of feels like a bit fresher from the, the other ones. Hey, Milano. Um, yeah, Vodka. It was just me and Vodka. This was not even, like, at the very beginning of the Twitch channel, either. It was just me and Vodka would sit here, and I would play Pikmin 2 and talk to Vodka. Um, that's an over-exaggeration. You could see at least maybe two other people talking in the the uh, VOD comments. But, yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. We got, we'll pick it up with two. <laughs> I don't know when we'll do it. Maybe we'll make, like, a whole month out of it. Um, yeah, that's honestly just, it's just me and Vodka talking every stream. Everyone else is an apparition. All right, PJ wants me to start the game. Uh, he's he's on a busy schedule, I guess. Um, I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be the chicken. All right, this is Puffin Man's voice actor, a look at. You're gonna get a character. You gotta match it to the uh, the cage. Uh, actually, I don't I don't really know what the uh, setup is. I just tried to logic it out, and I don't know. But you'll see. You'll you'll pick it up. All right, here we go. <clears throat> okay. Who shares a voice actor with Homer Simpson? There you go. So it's not actually the names of the voice actors, it's the characters. So you got Oogie Boogie, Genie, Captain Hook, or Phil. You should know it. <laughs> yeah. I have an emote that spoils the answer, so... We'll see if I can name the voice actors as well. So that'll be uh, Dan Castellaneta in every game except uh, Recoded, in which it is uh, Jim Meskimen. Um, oh, Merge! I'm, I'm the Genie! The Genie of the Lamp! Let me throw up my Homer Genie as well. Got to represent. There you go. All right. Number two. Uh, who shares... Uh... Oh, no! Oh, God. I read it. I read it too quick. <laughs> who shares a voice actor with Raiden from Mortal Kombat? From Mortal Kombat. And not Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, I frame one hit Axel when I read Raiden. Oh, it's so stupid. So, uh, yeah, I'm guessing that's Richard Epcar, uh, and not Billy Zane who voiced Raiden. Um, of course, my name is Epcar Pat, and I, I missed the Epcar question. God damn it. <laughs> that's so upsetting. Hopefully the next one is, uh, <laughs> hopefully the next one is, uh, Raiden from Metal Gear. Nobody axes Axel. Number three. Oh, fuck. Uh... Who shares a voice actor with the mayor from Powerpuff Girls? Owl in Cage 2, Smee, Merlin, or Rabbit in Cage 3? Um, 
This is a guess. Oh, fuck, shit, shit, shit. Looks like it's me. Oh, it looks like, oh, really, Tom Kenny? Tom Kenny is uh, the mayor? I had no idea. I never was a big Powerpuff Girls guy, so I wasn't uh, wasn't aware of that. Um, I picked Merlin. I thought uh, I could see that guy having a similar voice. That's uh, Jeff Bennett, I believe. Um, all right. <laughs> this is bad. This is got not going great for me. I'm um, uh, one for three now. Number four. Uh... Who shares a voice actor with Titus from FF10, Jack Sparrow in Cage 3, Prince Charming, the Prince from Dwarf Woodlands, or Prince Philip? It's either a prince or a pirate. Hmm. True, that's another big story, Olao. Uh, the remix OSTs are now on Spotify. Um, yeah, it is indeed the prince. Um, that is James Arnold Taylor. Um, he was Jack Sparrow in Cage 2, but he didn't do a very good job. And I love, you know, I love uh, Titus, but... Um, and Cage 3, I don't know the name of the voice actor, but he does do a better job. Kind of a shame I don't know the uh, <laughs> the name of the uh, better Jack performer there. But All right, number five, Jared Butler. There you go. Um, the actor who plays Steve from Full House also voices which character? Hercules in Cage 1, Hercules in Cage 2, Aladdin, or Simba? This one's, uh, to me, way easier than... Um, Questions two and three. <clears throat> yep, that'll be uh, Scott Weiner, um, I believe is his name. Um, Hercules Cage 1 is Sean Astin, Hercules Cage 2 is the original, Tate Donovan, and then Simba is uh, Cam Clark, not Matthew Broderick. They did not get Matthew. Hi, PJ, what's the matter? Uh, <laughs> why are you patting me? Why? Uh, <laughs> I don't think they're gonna come up later. I mean, maybe. I don't know if uh, Puffin Man reuses, uh... Oh, jeez. Um... I think I know, actually. Uh, who shares a voice actor with Spider-Man from Spectacular Spider-Man? Puffin Man, should I not talk about who voices the dummy answers? Um... Bum, 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 bum. I'll just, I'll just say who voices if I know the, the right answer. That'll be, uh, Josh Keaton, I think. Uh, oh, I didn't replicate? Okay. Um, I don't know. I mean, we don't know Drake Bell is a young Ericus, but yeah, young Hercules, um, and BBS is where he appears in, in the cage series. Yeah, I believe it's, it's different in the movie as well. <clears throat> All right, number seven. I forgot to look at the leaderboard because I was yapping. Okay, who shares the voice actor with Reno from FF7, Advent Children, Demix, Axel, Zigbar, or Zexian? Puffin Man says I can talk. I'm going to test my own voice actor knowledge. Outside of the questions. Fine, go talk then. <laughs> yep, Quentin Flynn is Axel and Reno, and also Ryden in Metal Gear Solid 2. Uh, Demix is Ryan uh, Donahue. Zigbar is James Patrick Stewart. Zexian is Vincent Corazza. Number eight. Oh, jeez. Uh... I think. Um, who shares a voice actor with Shredder from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2012? Zaldin, Sean Yu, Alexius, or Captain Gantu? I think I know this. Maybe? Uh, wait, wasn't. Okay. Okay, wasn't uh, the original Shredder Uncle Phil, um, James Avery? And then Captain Gantu is, uh, I think, is Kevin Michael Richardson, who's also. The KH voice actor for Sebastian. Um, Zaldan is David Dan Fisher. Lexius is Dave Boat. And I don't know um, any other characters of those guys' voice. I don't know who voices Sean Yu. Alright, number nine. Uh, see, I, I did kind of spoil this earlier, so maybe I should... Uh, <laughs> like, if you know who, vo uh, who plays Sam from Lord of the Rings, I kind of gave this one away, so... Um, I won't talk about the dummy answers anymore. Um, but yeah, Sean Astin, who plays Sam in Lord of the Rings, um, was for some reason who they got for Hercules and KH1. I don't think he did a bad job either, but then they got the real voice actor uh, back for every other game after. Um, <laughs> yeah, I guess you guys really thought Quasimodo. Uh, all right. Number 10. Number 10. 
Who shares the voice actress with the female version of Commander Shepard from Mass Effect? The Grand Councilwoman, Nala, Tifa, or Aurora? Carl! Hello! I guess I won't press the button since you did. Damn. Um, I was between Tifa and Nala, actually, so... Um, I think the Grand Councilwoman's voice actress actually passed away, like, not too long ago. Um, Zoe Caldwell. Um, I don't even know the name of the Aurora voice actress. Uh, oh wait, is that Jennifer Hale? Will Ruthie kill me? Um, okay, there you go. Yeah, Jennifer Hale is also, uh, Cinderella. Um, there you go. Let's check in at 10 questions. Ralph St. Snack, that's good. Um, we got, uh, it's Kyle, PJ, sorry, Kyle, Siv, Fruitcake, uh, me, PJ. Number 11. Um, the actor who plays King George in the musical Hamilton, the original cast, also voices which character? Kristoff, Hans, Flynn Rider, or Sven? It's either a Frozen or Tangled character. I do know this. In fact, I reference it uh, in a video. It is Kristoff, Jonathan Groff, um, in the original Broadway run of Hamilton. Okay. Oh, wait, we have to look at this. Number 12, Chris Groff. Uh, Liquid Snake. Uh, well, I had no idea. Um, well, it can't be, it's gotta be one of those. Uh, who shares a voice actor with Liquid Snake from Metal Gear Solid? Simba, Zigbar, Jack, or Master Masters? Nice! I was like, I would know if James Patrick Stewart was Liquid Snake, so I was like, there's no way it's fucking Chris Sarandon. And then I think I would also know if it was Ray Chase. So it's uh, Cam Clark, um, which is not the original uh, Simba, but I guess he also did uh, Liquid. That's crazy. Otacon, I'm a lion now. <laughs> Number 13. Uh, the actor who plays Cliff from Cheers also voices which character? Timon, Ham, Rex, or Sully? That took me a sec. <coughs> uh, I guess I'm a boomer, because I, I recognize this person. At least I think I do. Uh, I'm pretty sure that is John Ratzenberger. Or John Ratzenberg. Is it, is it a burger or a burg? I'm not sure, but... Um, he has a voice in, like, almost every, uh, Pixar movie, so he's Ham in Toy Story, he's the Abominable Snowman in Monsters, Inc., um, he's P.T. Flea in Bugs Life, uh, I can't think of any others. Is he in Finding Nemo? Ratzenberger, there you go. What's up, KSM? Um, yeah, welcome to the Himalayas, yeah. Uh, there you go. I don't think, yeah, these other three... Oh no, they got the original Rex for um, for Toy Box, but Timon and Sully were recasts. Number fourteen. <clears throat> oh, I don't know. Um, uh, who shares a voice actor with Count Dooku from the Clone Wars? Ansem the Wise in Cage Two, Master Xehanort, Yun Sid, or Ansem Secret of Darkness? Uh, <laughs> I've heard of this guy, but. Nice. It's always a safe bet to go with Yen Sid or Corey Burton, because Corey Burton voices everybody. Um, so I figured I'm casting the widest net by guessing the Corey Burton character. Uh, <laughs> great, great pull there, Barty. Um, yeah, so Anson the White's Cage 2 would have been uh, Christopher Lee. Um, and I does, doesn't he voice... Wasn't he a, a different character in Star Wars? It's Corey doing a Christopher Lee imp uh, impression. There you go. Which is what he ends up doing for Kingdom Hearts. So he ends up, you know, taking over for Ransom the Wise. Lee played him in the movie. Gotcha. There you go. All right. <clears throat> um, number 15. Uh, I would think. Who shares a voice actor with Cyborg from Teen Titans? Mushu, Oogie Boogie, Gogo, -Go, or Wasabi? It's gotta be one of two, and I would think that it's gotta be the one I... <laughs> Not White Mushu! <laughs> right? It's gotta be... Yeah, so... Kari Payton, I believe. Uh, who's not who voiced him in um, the movie, but that's who they got for Kingdom Hearts. 
Um, yeah, Mushu is Mark Mosley, White Mushu. They did not get Eddie Murphy for Kingdom Hearts. And then I figured Oogie Boogie is too old. Um, and Gogo is, is a woman. All right, 15. <clears throat> Unless she had, like, amazing range. Uh, we got Kyle, me, PJ, Fruitoon, and Ralph St. Snack. Number 16. Uh. Oh. Oh, God, I have no idea. Wait, uh. Who shares a voice actor was Wanda from Fairly Odd Parents? Okay. I got that at the last second. I was like, oh man, it's such a different voice. Uh, <laughs> Suzanne Blakesley. Um, I think Fairy Godmother um, was, I think that was Rusty Taylor, right? Until she passed away. Um, and that's Barbara Derrickson. Queen of Hearts is Tress McNeil. I'm not sure who Flora is. So yeah, there, and Maleficent is also a fairy. So she, uh, it's two different fairies of two very different types. Um, <laughs> Meteors of Heaven! I can't do a Wanda voice, obviously. Uh, alright, let's see. Unleash Thy Fury. 17. Uh... Who shares a voice actor with Skullface from Metal Gear Solid 5? Uh, Cage 2 Sephiroth, Scar, Luxord, or Saix? Um... I'm just kind of doing a... Educated guess. Damn. Scar. Uh, that'd be... It's not Jeremy Irons. Uh, James Horan? Horan, I think, is his name? Yeah. Um, and then it's not George Newbern. I thought Robin Atkin Downs was a good guess. I feel like he's fairly uh, prolific in terms of the characters he voices. Um, he's uh, also Davy Jones um, in KH3. And it's not uh, Kirk Thornton. Okay. <clears throat> Number 18. Uh, right, okay, that was complicated. Uh, who shares the voice actors with Rapunzel from Tangled? Rapunzel in Cage 3, <laughs> Yuffie in Cage 1, Tifa or Aerith in Cage 1. Um, yeah, this one's kind of, uh, kind of funny. <clears throat> yeah, so it's Mandy Moore voices Rapunzel in the movie, um, but then back in 2002, they got her for Aerith in Cage 1, um, and then I don't know who actually voices Rapunzel in Cage 3, and then Yuffie is uh, Christy Carlson Romano in KH1, and then they replaced her with Mae Whitman. Okay, I don't know who voices Tifa. Oh, wait, no, Rachel Lee Cook, I think, for Tifa. <clears throat> Number 19. Oh, wow. Uh... <laughs> uh, who shares a voice actor with Bubble Bass from SpongeBob? Um, Cogsworth, Young Xehanort, Smee, or Waka? I am making another educated guess here. Yeah, same. It just fits for me. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Waka is uh, D. Bradley Baker um, in KH1. Uh, in uh, Final Fantasy, I think he's... Uh, how many times? 33. Thank you for the follow. Um, Cogsworth is uh, David Ogden Stiers. Young Zaynor is uh, Ben Diskin. And I think Smee is... Is he also Jeff Bennett? John DiMaggio. There you go. Okay. Number 20. <clears throat> um, okay. <laughs> God, I really had to parse that out. Who shares the voice actor with Chip from Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas? Vanitas, Flounder, Young Sora, or Young Xehanort? This is, this is very funny. Um, yeah, it is indeed Vanitas. Obviously, uh, Chip does not sound like Vanitas, but as a child, uh, Haley Joel Osment voiced Chip in only the uh, Beauty and the Beast sequel, and then would go on to voice Vanitas. Young Sora um, is, you know, while HJO was definitely young when he voiced Sora, he did not voice a young Sora, who you see in BBS, who is, uh, I believe his name is Luke Manriquez. And then Flounder, I don't know who voiced him. And it's also, nobody guessed the uh, young Xehanort. So that's, that's a very fun question. All right, let's look five questions out from the finale here. We've got, yeah, Fish with a Mortgage, that's right. Uh, Kyle, PJ, me, Ralph, and Fruitcake, number 21. Oh, geez. Uh, who 
Who shares a voice actor with Ramon from Cars? I don't even remember this car. Uh, Shenzi, Zigbar, Banzai, or Rai? Two hyenas. Uh... Bum, 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 bum. Oh my god. <laughs> I got lucky. So Cheech Marin is, uh... That's true. The, the child actors who portray the young characters are no longer children anymore. They're probably, like, my age. Um, because you figure... Whoever voiced Sora in 2010 was probably... I guess they're probably still a little bit younger than me. Um, they're probably in, like, their 20s, though. Okay, there you go. <clears throat> it's Cheech. We're 22. Um, the actor who plays Vizini in The Princess Bride also voices which character? I have not seen The Princess Bride, but I recognize the face. Um, Timon, Pumbaa, Rex, or Dr. Finkelstein? <clears throat> no, they actually did get Cheech Marin for uh, Cage 2. They did not get Whoopi, though. Um, yep, that's Wallace Shawn, who is Rex from uh, Toy Box, Toy Story. Yeah, I know. I know. That's like a big one that I've missed. Um, Princess Bride. Okay, 23. Um, who shares a voice actor with Ozai from Avatar The Last Airbender? This is the one we uh, talk about quite a lot in the stream. Uh, the Emperor from Land of Dragons, Ericus, uh, Master Xehanort, or Judge Frollo? <clears throat> <clears throat> it is indeed Ericus, Mark Hamill. Uh, Alright. 24. Um, who shares a voice actor with Carl? Uh, Pooh, Quasimodo, Smee, or the Grand Duke? Yes, yeah, sorry. Phoenix King Ozai, Vaka's avatar crush. Carl! <laughs> um... I do know this. <clears throat> it is uh, Rob Paulson, who is the Grand Duke and also Jacques in uh, BBS. Um, Pooh is uh, Jim Cummings. Um, <laughs> someone rang? Who shares a voice actor with Carl from Jimmy Neutron? Aw, oh, jeez, Jim. All right, 25. Uh, <laughs> who shares a voice actor with Theodore from Alvin and the Chipmunks 2007? Chip, Dale, Titus, or Roxas? Um, <laughs> took me a sec. <clears throat> Bow. Um, I kind of forgot <laughs> that uh, Jesse McCartney voiced a chipmunk, but uh, I knew that none of these voiced uh, Theodore. So, yeah, Jesse McCartney was Theodore. Um, I believe, was it also Rusty Taylor who did the chipmunks? Um, or no, because... Maybe it's Chess McNeil? Oh no, uh, Cor Corey Burton is one of them. I think Corey Burton might be Dale. Um, Alright, there you go. Well, let's check out our leaderboard here. In third place, it's Kyle. In second, it's PJ. And first... Oh, you hate to see that, PJ. I hate to see it. Uh, it's me. <laughs> Alright. And then in fourth, it's Ralph. And then in fifth, it's Fruitoon. Those are our leaderboard members. Bullshit. <laughs> and then we got uh, the voice actory Estavles in sixth. VA Break, that's David Daybreak in 7th, Sib in 8th, Silver Inferno in 9th, and VA Blossom in 10th. Thank you so much to Puffin Man for making this one for us. I uh, really appreciate that. I had a lot of fun. I love the voice actor ones because I usually do pretty well on them. Uh, let's see on the report here. Um, try not to overestimate. I feel like the the when I guess best, I'm like on the 4th or 5th place spot because I'm not overestimating how... Uh, how often people got them right. Um, so I'm going to say 46%. Ah, 44. Okay. Um, uh, let's take a look at our schedule moving forward here. That was a great one there. Um, enemy close-up trivia by RMS on Saturday. That'll be our slide two Saturday at 4 p.m. slot. Um, you're going to get a picture of an enemy close-up, all pixelated. You got to pick which enemy it is from the cage series. Then we have some general trivia by Vodka Tuesday at 6, and some more general trivia by RMS a uh, week from today at 6. And then everything after that is TBD because I'm going to be out of town again next weekend. So we're going to probably do a makeup stream at some point, but I'll uh, let you know as we get closer to that. So, all right, there we go for the Look It. Let's try out the Hurdle. Um, yeah, you got to be careful, PJ. Um, let's see. Make this up a bit. 
Hey, how many times? 33. Thank you for the sub. Appreciate that. Um... Um, ba -ba -da, that's a uh, shouting dark cloud. Yeah, I always have to think if that's squirming evil or not. There you go. I wonder if we're like looping back around to ones we've played on stream before. That's entirely possible at this point. So, all right, there you go, folks. That's the hurdle and the trivia. If you want more trivia, we'll be back Saturday at four for that enemy close up stuff and then slide two. Um, but if you'd like to stick around, we're going to be playing some Birth by Sleep. You can pick which character I play as and what we pursue on our quest for 46 trophies. We're at 20 right now, so a bit of an uphill battle still. But um, yeah, bye, VOD people.